We started exploring shared augmented reality experiences all the way back in 2019. And we found the phones to be amazing. They were really, really good for what we were trying to do then. But we realized there was a bit of a bottleneck. What if we wanted other kinds of devices like your smart glasses or your robots to also join into these coordinate systems? And that's where it clicked when we realized that the world actually will be full of smart glasses and robots and there will be less and less smartphones. And one of the things that we thought in the very beginning is that let's try and share coordinates rather than video feeds. And this is where we created the Aoki Network. That is this shared coordinate system that all devices, uh, no matter what brand it is or what application they're running, can connect to. And this is where we realized that our QR codes are great anchors that create persistent coordinate systems that can be joined asynchronously, allowing for all kinds of devices to join. The next challenge we found is that how do you take a 2D device and show them a 3D map? How do you get them to navigate from different locations using a map in 3D space? How can we create a world where all devices agree on their location? The next thing that we're going to be working on is shared perception. Now you can start creating digital anchors inside these maps collaboratively. This allows for each device to use less compute because the information is already available to them. So now devices won't have to run the same visual language models. They can use shared visual language models that have already been mapped out to navigate these spaces. It'll just tell them exactly where things are. In this process, we have helped phones to free up space, use less compute, help devices find where they are, and very soon share their own perception with the rest. If this is something that you're interested in, you should come and talk to us. You should build something on the Alki network.